we have a scene. It's not your typical scene, but it's a scene of the sons, Ham and Shem and Jacob, while they're lounging in the sun, sort of sunning themselves, getting ready for, well, a father and son, a father and son event where fathers and sons spend time together. In this case, building a major project. Let's take a look. Ham, Shem, Japheth, where are you guys? Hey, come here. I've got some exciting news. Look at that. We're going to build an ark. What is that, Dad? These are the plans for an ark. All right. Right on. Yeah, all right. Uh, Dad, uh, what's an ark? An ark is a boat. Terrific. Then we can pretend to be explorers paddling our canoes across the uncharted waters. No, son. It's going to be much larger than a canoe. Well, how, how big can it be, Dad? Well, come over here and look at the plans. Mom. It's going to be... Can you hold my hand? I sure can. <laughs> It's going to be 300 cubits long, 50 cubits wide, and 30 cubits tall. Wow. Huh? Wow. Colossal. Hey, yeah. colossal. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but what's a cubit, Dad? <laughs> Son, a cubit, put your, put your arm up here. Okay. A cubit is the distance between your elbow and your fingertips. Wow. That boy. That was a cubit, huh? Okay. Yeah. We got 300. So 300 of them. Yeah. Wow. 50. 30. Big. <laughs> Dad, don't you think the boat's a little big for our family? You can fit two of every animal on earth in it. <laughs> and that's exactly what we'll do. <laughs> wow. Think of all the color. Oh, no. Wait a minute, Dad. Think of all the noise. <laughs> and think of all the... Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, no. the boat, Dad. oh, that's you. <laughs> oh, there's a shovel there, okay. <laughs> well, let's see. I think I'll be the captain of this ark. So it certainly won't be me that's going to clean up this mess. Uh, I can't will be the first mate because I'm the oldest in the ark. Well, I am. I'm going to be busy in the galley making sandwiches for the trip. Why can't I make the sandwiches and you clean the Oh, well, you know, because on cruises, everybody wants ham sandwiches on the ride on the tail. Uh, well, congratulations, son. It's your job. <laughs> You're welcome. Dad, we don't live near a lake big enough to sail the boat. Why are we going to put all the animals on a boat we can't sail? It? <laughs> it's very simple. Good, good point. I can, I can get rid of this. That's just a good point. No, you hang on to that. The Lord is going to make it rain. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> uh, what's rain, Dad? Now, in those days, the earth had not seen rain, but it was watered by a mist that rose from the ground. Rain is water that falls in big drops from the sky. Huh? Oh, come on, Dad. You've got to be joking now. Come on, that's not true. Uh, yeah, yeah. Water going to fall from <laughs> the sky? I'm not joking. <laughs> and the fountains in the deep are going to be broken open. Fountains? How much water are we talking here? A buck or four or two? <laughs> <laughs> Enough water to cover all the mountains of the earth. Oh, so that's why the boat has to be so big to hold all those animals. Mm, I Isn't, get it. It. Isn't this kind of, well, big for a father-son project? <laughs> we uh, can do it. We can do it, boys. I have the plans right here. Come on. Wait, 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 before we build it. I have an idea. Let's what? build a smaller boat, just big enough for the family, and then God can make new animals. It's a novel idea, but we'll do it the Lord's way. Come on. Uh, afraid of that. 
I was afraid of that. Well, the producers of this play wish to bring you an important disclaimer. Government regulations